The world of music was brought to the classroom in southwest Saskatchewan during the 6th annual Chinook Music Week celebration. Close to 500 students from Swift Current, Maple Creek and Gull Lake participated in a series of workshops learning about world drumming, percussion and ORF. If you learn solfege, you've ever seen the sound of music with the whole do, re, mi, fa, so, that's where all that comes from. Uh, ORF has a lot of percussion instruments and a lot of drumming elements as well as working on mallet instruments as well and teaching students about um, pitches and music and things like that. So it's a really neat uh, way for young students that maybe are not old enough to uh, play a, a wind instrument to have an opportunity to make music. Joseph Ashong was one of the musicians sharing his talents with the students, which included a range of drumming techniques to dance. Ashong was born in West Africa and a member of the National Dance Ensemble of Ghana for six years and a member of the Guinea Ballet before coming to Canada in the early 90s. Now living in Saskatoon, he's taught summer classes at the U of S and also keeps busy throughout the year educating students across the province of the importance of music. It's important for me to go to the schools and you know, teach the kids about my culture because not everybody will get a chance to go to Africa. You know, so they, they can learn more about the village life and the city life and everything. My mom from the village, my dad from the city, and I enjoyed being in the village because always, always, they don't have much, but they're always happy because there's a drumming and music and singing and dancing and just people, the joy in the village make me want to spend more time in the village. He goes on to add that society as a whole could learn a lot from music. If we only took the time to relax more from our regular routine. A little bit, a little bit too serious. <laughs> yeah, you know, so, um, you know, when I go to the schools, um, sometimes I would like to, the kids to know that music is supposed to be healing, you know, it's supposed to be fun. Um, that's what we do in the village, you know, people, when you see somebody drumming, always there's a smile on their face. Somebody dancing, smiling, and just the joy, you know, and I think if we can go to the schools and share this to the schools, the kids will grow up and they will learn the same thing. The sixth annual Chinook Music Week focused on classroom music, with a 2013 event already in the planning stage.